They're America's front line. High speed, high tech, and totally real. They're the men and women of the Border Patrol. Land, sea, and air. Right along with the real United States Border Patrol. As they protect our borders and coastlines, implement drug enforcement, carry out combat missions, and fortify its prominent position as guardian against terrorism as part of the Department of Homeland Security. Their mission is to secure our borders, cover thousands of miles of coastline, and stop terrorists in their tracks. From the waters of Florida to the Arizona desert, these officers put their lives on the line to keep America safe. The Border Patrol team is made up of experts in their field with years of experience in military and law enforcement, like Eric Grimes, a senior officer who has seen it all. You have good boaters, you have bad boaters, you have nice people, you have people that are not so nice. Every time we take it out now, we get stopped or harassed, so we don't take it out at all. Okay. Would I consider this job dangerous? Yes, it's very dangerous. We work in a dynamic environment. We deal with illegals. They're committing felonies, bringing in illegal contraband into the U.S. They don't want to cooperate with you. Then there's Eddie Perez, the local boy. I was born and raised here in Miami. This is my backyard. I'm going to protect it to the fullest with the authority that's vested in me. I've been involved in many, many chases with many, many pounds of cocaine and marijuana and different nationalities. It's not just the Bahamians and it's not just the Cubans or the illegals that come in here. There's, there's many nationalities that try to come into this country. Firearms and ballistic expert Doug Johnson. On every customs vessel, every officer is required to have their primary sidearm, which I have here. This is my Glock 9mm. <laughs> Additionally, on every interceptor vessel, you will find what we call a disabling shotgun. It has a laser sight on the front and fires a special munition that we use to take care of uh, other vessels. We use this for firing warning shots and for disabling other vessels. My personal choice of weapon is the Colt M4. It has a collapsible stock, which is good for close quarters maneuvering. It also has a short barrel. This weapon will allow us to cover a person when we encounter them if we anticipate any type of violence or any type of other weapons. And it can also be used at long range. If a gunfight erupts, we can shoot from considerable distance and still be very accurate and take out our intended target. Border Patrol will take the viewer on up close, in depth, totally real, totally Great. dangerous missions. Like when the Miami team gets a call from a surveillance plane. The air side of our division is up patrolling, and they've spotted the a vessel approximately 24 uh, miles out leaving from a direction as if he was coming from the Bahamas and he's headed toward Port Everglades. We're going to go out and intercept there the vessel. Are. Officer Grimes and the team spot the suspect vessel and they move in to investigate. We're U.S. Customs and Border Protection. Where are you guys coming in from? Bimini. Bimini. Yeah. What time did you leave Bimini? 10.58. 10.58. Okay, how many people you have on board? Just, us. Just you two? Yeah. Are there any weapons on board? One. One weapon? Yeah, we're going to come aboard right quick. And it's a gritty, unfiltered look at one of our government's most essential forces and the men and women who put their lives on the line to keep us safe. This is America's front line. This is Border Patrol.